Stop eating! You keep eating all the snacks and not saving any for me! That's because your ass is already big enough! <gasps> I'm about to show you in this extremely expressive try on bikini haul. I'm gonna be showing you bikinis that you wish you had. You're gonna be running to the store and purchasing them ASAP. P.S. Comment which number subscriber you are down below. I should have probably prepared for this bikini shoot a little bit better because I've literally been eating a shit ton, a shit ton of unhealthy snacks, specifically these marshmallow eggs. Mm. I mean, I literally feel like I never have to go out again because whenever I eat one of these, it literally feels like there's a party in my mouth. I think I'm just gonna dive into one of my sluttiest bikinis because, I mean, more skin exposure means maximum tan. And we can both agree that this girl needs a tan because at this point I'm currently reflecting the sunlight rather than absorbing it. It's a bit of a problem. I'm so excited to show you guys my bikini. Bikini number one, red heart. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, on inside the shops, I literally looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, oh my gosh, I am a hoe. Ho, ho, ho. And I was like, no way in a million years am I gonna buy this slutty bikini. I mean, my boobs are basically falling out of the middle here. But, 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 after about three minutes, I was like, oh my gosh, I am loving this. I feel like it's my inner self. The only issue is that all the beaches that I go to, everyone literally wears like such conservative swimming costumes. I'm talking granny panty style, full on covered. And I'm like the hoe on the beach. Like I can just imagine myself as I'm walking towards the ocean to go for like a little swim. I'd be like holding my ass cheeks and covering them up because I'm gonna be like, oh my gosh, everyone's staring at my jiggly bum. So let's work our way through this bikini. From the bottom. Firstly, this uh, bikini bottom is super tiny. I kind of feel like my coochie is gonna pop out at any second, but it's okay. If you just kind of like walk calmly, then it's unlikely to happen. Whew. Also make sure that you tie these strings on the side in a double knot because you know the worst thing that can happen is when this little knot comes undone and you're basically like at the beach, like this. I mean being there done that and I don't really ever want that to happen to me again so now I make like double or triple knots on the side. How to wear a bikini. Oh my gosh, you know these earrings guys are taking some real commitment to wear them right now because they're super distracting. They're so heavy. I feel like my earlobes are going to be stretched out really long. Screw it. I'm taking them out now. I can't take this. Oh, I literally bought these things like a year ago and I've never worn them. And then I was like, today is the day that I'm wearing these really big hoops because we all know the bigger the hoop, the bigger the brains. <laughs> So the back of this bikini is so cute. It's actually supposed to be like a Brazilian style bikini bottom. You know Brazilian style, how it kind of like goes like this. This booty over here has literally consumed the bikini. I mean, I have quite a big ass and it's literally like, I'm like, I'm eating it up. I absolutely love this bikini top. I mean, look how great it makes my titties look. I mean, I literally have a size A, but my boobs look like a triple B. GG's, baby. Oh my gosh, that one's like popping out. Also, just look how cute this back is i mean it's got this really cute design cutout design at first i was really worried that i was gonna get these like gross fat rolls hanging out over here but surprisingly surprisingly she's breaking with me and she's not doing that to me Woo i'm excited to wear it to the beach comment down below if you love it because i love it i actually kind of hate this bikini i mean i think the back of it is kind of cute but i don't know i'm not so convinced i mean i literally just wear it because i bought it in miami and as you guys know i'm not in miami bitch <sighs> so it's not like i can return it or anything so i just gotta live with it but you know anyway i thought that i would just share this bikini with you guys and it's kind of average you know i'm not gonna stand out in the crowd like i would in that red one and your girl wants to stand out in the crowd if you know what i mean and i mean the other thing is that this bikini was super expensive <laughs> And I bought it because I was so desperate for a bikini because I didn't have a bikini and so I just bought this one and I now live with regret. Next up, we got a cozy for a fat day. You know when you're having like one of those fat days when you've eaten a whole load the day before and you wake up the next morning and you're super bloated and you still haven't had your morning poo poo and it's just, you know, it's not your day and you're self-conscious about your bloated stomach and you're like, I don't want to wear a bikini. 
Well, I've got a solution for you. I literally think that this is the best full swimming costume for a self-conscious day because because where to begin where to begin i feel like we need to start at the back because i can really appreciate this back firstly it is well once again the swimming costume is kind of meant to sit out like this but because my ass is so big it lands up sliding in and eating it all up so i kind of wear it like a g-string bikini and you know what whatever that's fine look at this amazing back i mean it's got these super long crisscross straps and on the side it kind of cuts like this so it's very flattering but best of all I would say is the front. I mean, look at the shape that it gives me. It literally makes my waist look super tiny. It gives this illusion of like an extreme hourglass shape, which I am dying for. I think on a day when you're just not feeling it and you're feeling self-conscious and you honestly feel like just canceling your plans, this is your girl. Just trust me. I got your backs, girls. I got your backs. Also, can I just have a little bit of appreciation for this beautiful beach setup that I have going here for you guys? <sighs> I haven't been to the beach in weeks and take me to the beach take me to the beach i'm ready i'm ready this bikini is vintage <gasps> it was my mother's Bravo. Bravo to my mother. so my mother is actually a hoarder okay and it's actually a bit of a problem i genuinely feel like she would be one of those people that needs to be on one of those episodes of like hoarder, extreme hoarder. Come to the front door and there's a lot of things I have to climb over. Yeah, because she's kept all of her clothes since she was like 16 years old, it means I get to wear her vintage stuff that's all coming back in fashion. Can you believe it? I mean guys, I am all for this high rise wrap around string around the body, this kind of like bra style swimming costume top. Because it's like a string in the front here, you can adjust how wide or narrow you want this part to be. I mean, I kind of think that that is pretty freaking weird, so I stick to it being a bit wider, but... And whatever you like, you can style it however you like. I keep saying how you like, so yeah, however you like. I love wearing a swimming costume when I'm doing like beach sports. Let's say I'm throwing a frisbee or playing bat and ball or something like that. This bikini is gonna stay in place. I mean, yes, I'll probably have a bit of a wedgie, but hey, I've got wedgies in every single bikini. So this one's great because it gives a bit of support to the titties. And also, I've got full coverage on the JJ, so I don't have to worry about anything slipping out. I really love her. I think she's so cute. Um, honestly, this is probably one of my go-to bikinis, which is kind of funny considering it's literally from like the 1990s. <laughs> As an alternative top, you could wear something like this. Oh, it's cute. Straighten her up. Straighten her up. I think this is such a cute crop top. I mean, <laughs> it's got like these little holes all the way throughout, except for over the nipsies, nipsies. I mean, I just think that this looks so cute, this black top with this black bikini bottom. This is if you feel like something a little bit more fashionable, I suppose. I wouldn't recommend catching a tan in this because you're gonna land up with like all of these spots over your body and you look like you've got chicken pox 2.0. So that I would not recommend. And this is an even better alternative for sports, obviously, because you can jump around and do all kinds of things while wearing this top and nothing's gonna come out, which is really great. And here we have another top option. I mean, it even says fashion fashion on it which i mean that says it all doesn't it because it's fashionable now i'm not gonna lie this top is even scarier to catch a tan i mean like i don't know if tanned arms and like white chest is your thing then go for it you know catch a tan on this it'll be a look you'll have a brown neck and a white chest it's fabulous honestly i think i just bought this bikini for the color I mean, honestly, pastels are my schmastels. I love it so much. The back of it is slightly problematic with how tiny it is. I mean, I'm basically naked. Yes, I love her. Yes, she was overpriced. Yes, she's freaking tiny. And yes, she's possibly one of my favorites. I got slutty cozy, you know, the one from the beginning of this video, and this pink cozy from the same shop. So I kind of feel like it's going to be my go-to cozy shop from now on. I mean, they were my two most recent purchases, so I kind of feel like they had the right to be favored. I mean, not in the way that my mother favors my brother. And I just love them. So yeah, I'm going to be wearing them all the time. Woo! Also, I never know if I'm going to wear these bikinis with these like super high vibes. Vows. Because sometimes my mother tells me, Cassandra, you need to wear it on your hips and not like up here. 
But I saw a photo of Kendall Jenner and she was wearing it up here, so I feel like that's how I'm meant to wear it. Pastel colors are so flattering on the skin. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like it makes you look more tanned and things. Anything, pastel pink, pastel green, pastel blue, pastel, pastel, pastel purple. Confidence and key on your body, on your skin, and love yourself. Currently, I can't go to Hawaii, so I brought Hawaii to me, bitches. I'm literally wearing a palm tree. The leaves are wrapping me up like one of those Easter eggs. Also, my Daisy Keach boudet is on full display. In all honesty, she kind of needs a lot of work. And it's a bit of a problem because I literally only work out whenever I film workout videos for this channel. So that means that I've literally worked out three times this year. Oh well. It's got like these cut out little strings on the side here. So it gives, gives a little bit more of an interesting feel to the swimming costume. Also on the side here, I really like it. I mean, if I had a little bit more titties, then you can imagine like I would have a really nice side boob going on, but. Have you guys ever envied those little kids swimming cozies with like little frills and the extensions? Well, well envy no more. She's cute, she's pink. She's got frills on the top and on the bottom. I'm like a little, a little fish swimming around. I feel so cute. I mean, is this or is this not literally the cutest bikini you've ever seen? <gasps> I love her. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's adorable. I think that she's really flattering. She's doing a lot for the babies. I have to mention that I love the frill on the bottom because you know sometimes when you're wearing a bikini and you have like a little bit of overhang on the side here and you feel super self-conscious about that? Fear no more! This frill kind of hides it. It's a great way to cover up like little bits and bobs that you're maybe self-conscious about. Not that I think anyone else actually notices but it's not about what other people see. It's about the confidence that you feel when you're walking on the beach and you're strutting your stuff and you're diving into the waves and going for a swim. I have to show you guys the swimming costume. I literally am wearing avocados. Avocados! I mean, how cute is this? If you love avocado pears like I do because I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with avocado and I just love avocado. So I just, you know what? I'm gonna wear avocado. I'm gonna become an avocado and I'm gonna be an avocado and I'm gonna wear an avocado. Okay, so that's enough about avocados. I'll see you all in my next video. If you wanna see my face again, subscribe!